Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Yes, It's Your Wrestling, and woo wee It's already WrestleMania weekend, and me, I'm going to be pumping out the content. My plan from today to Monday is to make nine videos, upload nine videos in that span. Because today, I'm going to be doing this, the video I'm doing right now, the Wrestle, ranking WrestleMania matches. I'm going to be doing my SmackDown preview. Tomorrow, I plan on doing my WrestleMania predictions and my SmackDown review and maybe a few of the breaking every WrestleMania match. Then Sunday, I'm doing my WrestleMania Night 1 review, some more of the ranking every WrestleMania match. Then Monday, I'm going to be doing my WrestleMania one, Night 1 review and my preview for the Raw. And then I just remembered Tuesday, I'm going to be making another one. For review so that's about 11 or 12 videos from now to tuesday buckle up guys it's gonna be a busy weekend for me uh hopefully you guys enjoy all my content i'm gonna be making in the next four or so days but let's get into the video so of course since miz is the wrestlemania host we'll be doing the miz in the six woman tag team match with damage control taking on lita trish stratus and becky lynch but the thing is of course dakota Kai and eos sky has never had a wrestlemania match so i can't rank them and Lito, surprisingly, in her illustrious career, has only had one WrestleMania match, and it's one Trish Stratus that we're going to talk about. So we're not, so there's three out of seven already. So we're only going to be ranking four here. So let's go. So let's start off with Bailey, because uh, she has the least amount of all four of them. Uh, coming in at number three is WrestleMania 36 in the Fatal Five Way. I think it was elimination match, yeah. For the SmackDown Women's Championship, Bailey defending against Lacey Evans, Tamina, Naomi, and Sasha Banks. Uh, I think the story was if was Sasha turned on Bailey, she did not, and Bailey retained, and it was a pandemic or something, so it was an all right match. My camera was just malfunctioning, but next at number two we have the WrestleMania 35 Tag Team Championship match with uh, Bailey and Tasha Banks were actually champions going into the match, taking on Beth and Natalia, Tamina and Nia Jax, and the Iconics. And the Iconics actually won. It was an all right match. Like I said, Bailey has hadn't had the best matches at WrestleMania, but. It was an all right match, and I can't one, like I said, for Fatal 4 way tag title. Number one, though, is the Fatal 4 way for the Raw Women's Championship. I think it was another eliminations match. I just realized Bailey has never had a singles match at WrestleMania. Damn. Uh, but, and also, we're not counting Battle Royals. So here we have um, Bailey as a Raw Women's Champion. Dang, she's won into every WrestleMania as a champion. Okay, I, why am I thinking about this? Uh, is Bailey defending against Natalia. No, not Natalia. Bailey defending against Sasha Banks. Shara Flair, Nia Jax, Bailey's first ever WrestleMania. She won, and it was a pretty good match, in my opinion. Uh, elimination match again, like I said, pretty good match. Next, we'll do Trish Stratus, who, who had five. So coming in number five is the six-person tag team match at WrestleMania third at WrestleMania 27. John Morrison, Trish Stratus, and Snooki versus Lay Cool and Dolph Ziggler. I don't know what this match was. Bad match, bad WrestleMania. Yeah, uh, Trish Stratus' team won. Next, we got WrestleMania 21. It was Trish Stratus versus Christy Hemi. Trish Stratus was supposed to face Lita, but she got hurt, so it was Christy Hemi. I didn't even know who she was. Trish Stratus won, retained her title. Yeah. Next, we got WrestleMania 18. It was um, Trish Stratus, Lita, and Jazz. Uh, Lita's only WrestleMania match, like I said. And it was a good match. Uh, Jazz did retain her title. Like I said, it was a good triple threat match for the women's title. Actually, good women's matches at WrestleMania. Coming in number two was another triple threat match for the women's title. We got Jazz, Trish Stratus, but this time Victoria and Trish Stratus won. Uh, like I said, another pretty good triple threat match at WrestleMania. Uh, I'm, I'm glad, uh, I know now they do really good women's matches, but back then, every match was a Playboy match, Lumberjill match, Bras and Panties match. I don't even know what, what this man was doing back then, but yeah. Number one, though, is Trish Stratus versus Mickey James at WrestleMania 22. Great match. A great story as well. And uh, I, I'm pretty sure Mickey James won, but I don't really remember. I just know. Great match. Next, we got Becky Lynch. So coming in number five for Becky Lynch is WrestleMania 33, when she was in the six-pack women's challenge for the Ro for SmackDown Women's Championship. Uh, I'm pretty sure this was supposed to be in a kickoff show. It didn't really matter. Naomi won. Cool. Yeah. Next was WrestleMania 36, is when Becky Lynch defended against Shayna Baszler. Underwhelming match, all right match. Like I said, Shayna Baszler should have won uh, my other video, but, you know, Becky won. Next, surprisingly, is WrestleMania 35. In the first ever women's main event, Ronda, Charlotte, Becky. It was a great match. It was not a great match. It was a good match, but, like, underwhelming finish. Roll up that shouldn't, even, shouldn't have even counted. Underwhelming. Uh, but Becky Lynch won. 
So that was cool. WrestleMania 32, another triple threat match with Becky and Charlotte, but this time Sh Sh Sasha Banks was in there to crown the first ever women's champion and not Divas champion. Charlotte won that. It was a good match. I bet it pretty. I, I think it's better than a uh, main event. The um, number thirty-five. But number one was the absolute banger classic that it was last year when uh, that Becky and Bianca put on Becky Lynch versus Bianca Belair for the Raw Women's Championship last year. Oh wait, Chef's Kiss probably top two match of the night in my opinion. Great match. That's why it's number one for Becky. Next we got the Miz, who has had ten WrestleMania matches. Uh, a lot of these are like not the best, but let's go. Coming in at number 10, we have the Unified Tag Team Championship match at WrestleMania 26. Open the show. We have Show Miz defending their titles against John Morrison and R Troop. Weird. Don't really know why this match. Well, I know because they were a tag team and they won, but like still, it was like a two minute match they won. And yeah, that's really all that happened. Next, we got Team Johnny versus Team Teddy at WrestleMania 28 for control. And well, Miz's team won. I think it was on Johnny's team, but yeah. There's like a 12 man tag team match, like damn, but yeah. WrestleMania 30, at number eight, he was in the Andre Giant Memorial Battle Royal, the first one. The reason why it's this high is because, you know, it was, it was the first one, and it was actually a good match. You know, Cesaro won with a cool pop. He was in it, you know, one of the jobbers in it, but yeah. Okay, so this may be controversial or not, but coming in number seven, we have the WB Championship match main event, WrestleMania 27, The Miz defending against John Cena. He has the radar title because I did not I do not have the WWE championship. I don't know how I have that, but not the WWE title. But yeah, you know, this match is really disappointing. It ended in a draw, but then it got restarted with that stupid raw general manager. It was so bad. That's why it's number seven. Sticking with Miz and John Cena, we have Miz and Maurice taking on John Cena and Nikki Bella at WrestleMania 36. You know, I like this match. Some people may not like it, but I liked it. You know, WrestleMania 33 is my favorite WrestleMania of all time. In my opinion, well, that's because I have nostalgia for it. But yeah. And, uh, of course, the Bayface team won. John Morrison, uh, not John Cena, Nikki Bella. John Cena proposed to Nikki Bella. She said yes, but then, you know, they broke up after, like, three three months after that. Yeah, but I like this match. Coming in at number five, we had The Miz versus Shane McMahon. Falls count anywhere, WrestleMania 35. It was a good match. I like the ending with Miz suplexing uh, him out off the top of that scaffolding thing with Shane McMahon still winning, though. I like that ending. And, you know... Shane McMahon won, of course. Yeah, I like it. Shane McMahon is not bad at WrestleMania, actually. Coming in number five, though, we have John Morrison and The Miz teaming up with teaming up to go against Damian Priest and Bad Muddy at WrestleMania 37. We all know that I'm going on Bad Muddy hit that Canadian story on John Morrison, and of course, it's a great match. Damian and Bad Muddy won. Great match. That's why it's top five for The Miz. Actually, I retract the last time and I said that was number four. So this is number three. And number three is the WrestleMania 32 Intercontinental Championship ladder match with The Miz, Kevin Owens, Sami Zayn, Dolph Ziggler, Zack Ryder, um, Stardust, and Sin Cara. I'm not going to get all of them out because I have Sin Cara and Zack Ryder and Stardust too rotting on the bottom of my little box I got over there. Uh, good match for the Intercontinental Championship. Great moment for Zack Ryder to win. But The Miz won next night on Raw. So, yeah. Coming in number... Two, yeah, two. We got the most recent match, the Mysterios versus the Miz and Logan Paul. Woo! This was also a great match. Probably top five match at WrestleMania 38. It's funny. Last year, Mysterios are teaming up. This year, they're fighting each other. Yeah. Uh, but the Miz was good, and the Miz got the pinfall, and Logan Paul was great in this match. Logan Paul's debut match. Overall, great match. Number one, I mean, I've talked about this match many times. Pretty sure this was number one for Seth Rollins' ranking and number one for Finn Balor's ranking. Or, yeah... And there's number one for the Mrs. ranking. That's how good this match was. Opening at WrestleMania 34. Probably the, no, the best match at WrestleMania 34. Good match on a bad card. Uh, yeah, that's, that's Mrs. ranked. If y'all want on and, and to enjoy, hit that like button and subscribe if you want to. Getting, we're hitting next gear with WrestleMania weekend. You excited? I'm excited. Let's freaking go. See you on the next one.